disclaimer later on in the visit video there may be potentially problems with people with epilepsy that's actually pretty rad I like that I like that a lot apparently with the use these headlights uh, first flaw <laughs> you gotta be ranked so alright we're gonna review real quick uh, a new mod or try to it's a lighting mod hence why this is kind of perfect I want to start the game it's dark so I'm driving the con Marshall right now so I guess uh, stock headlights we're looking at something to that degree uh, on this mod it looks like it says it's gonna uh, you're gonna use like your air freshener slot or if you don't have an air freshener slot your bob blood slot so hopefully all my trucks have air freshener slots because it has to have a dachshund in it uh, and different style of headlights to reduce all the especially for snow match which is admittedly I took all my lights off the top of my trucks for snow maps because it's too much glare and too much it's blinding so it's supposed to help with that with pol polarized uh, lights and there's LED kits with different colors and then there he's gonna have a bunch of new like roof light positions it sounds like but it's only available for the CK1500 right now so I'm gonna go into the shop and uh, see what's see what the hell that's all about because I haven't even looked at it yet so I have no idea what it is or where it is or so obviously not engine gearbox suspension type blah 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 so what are we going to be under frame add-ons or, or probably the miscellaneous because he said it was yes there we go it just uses a slot so it's actually in miscellaneous oh, what do you mean they're all locked I have to reach level what's the shit okay so apparently with the use these headlights uh, first flaw <laughs> you gotta be ranked so I'm not gonna be able to I might have to go to my main game or something because this says get to level 15 at least to get these but we can at least so we got a uh, blue tint LEDs upgrade 2 is going to be it sees farther and wider basically then you got green red anti-glare polarized and white so that kind of uh, I'm level 9 so so much for that per se because now I'm, I guess I'm gonna have to uh, after this intro I think I might have to uh, pop into my main game for a second to uh, see what's going on there so uh, I guess I'll see you in a second and do that real quick back over into Alaska I picked up the CK1500 because that's the one that's supposed to have the roof stuff as well so I guess as before let's try and get some place where there's a little bit more snow for the glare effect so that can be easier said than done it shouldn't be we're on a snow map I don't want to just stay right by the garage but because I'm gonna go right back in the garage but I guess that'll be good enough so we see how we got all this reflection and glare back at you this isn't exactly the best spot to do it probably but we got snow maps are always kind of blinding if there's a lot of snow and ice reflecting back at you so that's gonna be our stock lights let's get up in the garage and do what we were gonna do a second ago and see what they got for the roof deal and uh, buy a set of anti-glare lights see the difference get up in here uh, so it was under miscellaneous but what about the there we go rooftop so round beak I think that was stock F upgraded flasher lights it says so that's probably one of the new new ones same thing with this upgraded flashlights and LED, LED bulbs for increased range we might have to do this separately though because then if I so that's just fogs because then that's not going to really show what the uh, 
lights look like if I have lights on top too because then it's going to be extra bright so let's try and go for the anti-glare one first so it shows I'll let you read that if you want to so let's just check out the headlight first so it actually doesn't look that doesn't look a hell of a lot different to me maybe get a little bit more of the rounded cone on the side like it says it looks like distance wise I think this one was supposed to be brighter maybe not maybe that was a stage two so we got that and I guess it does look a little does look a little less bright this is probably going to turn into a longer video but it would have been a quick one because now we might have to check all the lights real quick Anti upgrade two should be farther. And then, or should we just go straight for the? Or let's check the polarize first. Eliminates glare, improves visibility in low light conditions, sharpens visibility in the rain or snow. So, let's check out those ones. So those are dimmer. Much dimmer, actually. I'm sure it will decrease the range. Looks like it's darker, like in the cab, too. So, those are certainly going to be uh, less bright or less whatever. Do I like it? We'll see. So that was the anti-glare and the polarized. Then we got LEDs. The stage two are going to be going uh, farther. So we'll check out the LEDs first, I guess, before we check out the uh, farther stages. So these should be brighter. A lot much brighter these are more like some of the mod headlights so these are going to be way brighter obviously it looks like there's a bunch of combinations we could try because like for example this one we can put the roof lights on but then this is going to be back to the uh, probably shining back on you so the LEDs are certainly much brighter I don't necessarily need to test the uh, so now let's throw that one of those roof ones on there and go, maybe we'll do the roof and go back to the polarized because they're not as bright but then we'll have the rooftop one going on so actually we didn't even look at the so we gotta throw a beacon on there too but now it's probably gonna get screwed up if I want to put on the yeah that'll get screwed up with if I want to put on one of these so at least that's got a beacon too to see what the beacon looks different like and we'll go for the stage two polarized. Right, first turn on the beacons. So it's got a much 
more rotating deal there. You can even see it in cab. Epilepsy warning. We're going to turn that off because of that because I feel like the regular be beacons are... That could probably mess with somebody, I bet. So I might have to... Maybe I'll put a disclaimer in the beginning of... Okay, so let's try and turn on these lights now. That's kind of... Actually, that's kind of a rad look. That's actually pretty rad. I like that. I like that a lot. Because then it's got the polarized anti-glare going on with the headlights and these LEDs don't seem too uh, too crazy yeah those are those are kind of nice it's not as punishingly bright and it's nice cool color Yeah, I dig those a lot. That's pretty kind of cool. So those are those. I guess just for shits and giggles since we're in here or right here, I guess we'll check out one of the colored ones. I probably wouldn't run these, but what do we got? Blue, green, red. What do we want? Like green. Let's see what some green headlights look like. And this would be one where you probably shouldn't have the uh, rooftop thing. You can see the green tint to it, but it's clearly, obviously, those those roof lights that are. Uh, Providing all of the light. Because this doesn't look too different from that. It looks it does look a little bit more glary, so somehow Yeah, it's kinda wild. Somehow when I put the polarized lens lenses in there, it's almost like it changes the glare from the this does look slightly more glary and reflective than when it really just had. So that was our, uh, I don't know the name of this mod, I'm bad at those types of things, but it was, must have just came out, it was right in the begin beginning of the uh, mod list, so a headlight, headlight and beacon upgrade, uh, so that's that, that was uh, kind of cool, so if you want to get yourself some uh, potentially better headlights download yourself this uh... download yourself this mod why does it look like it's still got a green tint on it though then it can uh... increase the range and or different different options for headlights so that's kinda it's kind of cool because I have like some of the older mods that have old school like yellow headlights so it's kind of where we're getting with the polarized ones so kick okay, ass let's see if we can get this guy stuck since that didn't take long <laughs> oh wait I'm still won't take long but the whole point of this was just to uh just to check out the headlights so that was a mod for the headlights. Thank y'all for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and see y'all later. I'm working on Highway Hall and Map, but we're not going to show every task. I'm just going to work on something else. See you in a minute. Or see you later. Bye bye. <laughs>